The month of May is Lyme Disease Awareness Month. That's a disease associated with ticks. But researchers and educators warn that it's not the only disease carried by the troublesome insects. Eyewitness News reporter Ravathi Janaswamy has more on what to know for this year's tick season. The spring months mark the beginning of tick season. So all the ticks that tucker down uh, underneath the leaf litter and snow through the winter are out seeking a host. So we have a combination in the springtime of many different types of ticks that are active. While black-legged ticks or deer ticks are mainly associated with Lyme disease, it's not the only tick-borne disease. The Tick Diagnostic Testing Center at East Stroudsburg University tests for 17 pathogens related to ticks. Janice says it's important that people know there are more diseases out there to help medical diagnoses. So if you uh, are a physician treating just for Lyme disease, you might not be reaching the under uh, causing issue that's caused by something else and the treatment regimen may not be effective for that. To educate people, Pike County officials created the Pike County Tick-Borne Disease Task Force. The task force recently did a baseline study spanning the county that included the testing of 1,000 black-legged ticks. 123 ticks tested positive for two or more diseases. They found 38 percent of the ticks tested positive for Lyme disease. Lyme disease in Pike County has been a crisis and we could call it almost a, you know, a health-related issue for a number of years. Um, and this is prior to anything with COVID um, that we just, I was not aware of this six, seven years ago until some members of the uh, public came to us and said, this is a, this is a real uh, potential problem and we need to face this. Osterberg says those who were misdiagnosed have suffered and the goal is to prevent that from happening. Raythi Janaswamy, 2022 Eyewitness News. And if you find a tick on you, researchers ask that you mail it to the testing facility at East Stroudsburg University. And you can find out how on our website, pahomepage.com.